So guys, I'm going to be tasting the, um, the cinnamon water cracker. The Exotic Cinnamon Water Cracker. I'm going to be tasting, guys. And I also want to talk about the importance of water. Drinking water. And, um... These, um... Blue Mountain Peak Products Hot Drink. However you'd rather have it hot or cold. This is the coffee. This is the coffee, guys. So I'm going to be showing you how I mix my coffee um, sometimes I have my coffee with evaporated milk but I'll just have it let me pour so I pour the packet of coffee with the hot water depending on how strong everybody has their coffee sometimes I put Tom um, evaporated milk but this time I'll put just a little bit of sweet milk I take my I like my coffee with the the thick condensed milk guys. And this is the ginger. I've, I've tasted the Blue Mountain Tea coffee before and it's good. It's very good. And these are the um the ginger packets I've never had before. Uh, let's see the instruction here. I just want to give you guys my opinion of what I think about these drink. The instruction guide says to empty the packet and put 170 milliliter of hot water one of water hot water um, but um, I just put whatever amount of water I like to my tea my tea or coffee and then if it's too strong I put more water this is the green tea okay the green tea which is very good has lots of benefits the green teas are tea bags and um, these are the blue mountain peak the packets blue mountain peak coffee that I've tried before I'll tell you what I think about it and it's really good and um, also the ginger I've never tried before and the water cracker it's cinnamon tasty okay so then the green tea I like to take without I like to take the green tea without sugar guys I enjoy it that way and it reminds me of coffee the taste of the green tea it reminds me of coffee. So guys, cheers to coffee, the Blue Mountain Pea Coffee. Okay. That's the Jamaican Blue Mountain Pea Coffee. And um, Blue Mountain Pea Coffee is known as is considered to be the best coffee in the world. The Jamaican Blue Mountain Pea Coffee. It's good, guys. Very good. It's sweetened to taste. 
hot water sweetened to taste and it's enjoyable so you make you know we, we, we make our coffee to our liking how strong you want to have it now the ginger I brought the sugar I thought I would need the sugar but this is the ginger tea the 100% ginger Blue Mountain Peak and I would suppose it's the best ginger tea in the world also I've never tried it before for the first time thumbs up the instruction says um, to pour 170 ml of hot water but um, I just use my judgment guys I just put whatever water if you find it too strong and there was no sugar because um, there's sugar in it too cane sugar cane sugar which is a bonus I highly recommend guys I'm trying it on the spot and there you go for the first time it's good I love this and um, this is the green tea this is the Uncle Lee's 100% organic green tea guys I just drink it take it the way it is guys I don't put, add sugar to it but you could ha add sugar to it if you like it's very good the green tea is helpful like medicine in a medicine med medicinal way it did help me guys when I was shrinking fibroid and this is the water cracker cinnamon tasting It tastes like cinnamon and cinnamon is good for you too guys also cinnamon tea is good for you and the good old h2o water i'm just having this water plain guys but water in the morning with a bit of lime juice is good for you okay it washes flushes all the toxin from your from your body all the toxins from your body and get, gets rid of um, mucus and many other things like it's good for you first thing in the morning water with a little lime but i'm just having the plain water here cheers to water the staff of life so guys i just want to talk about the importance of <clears throat> The good old HTO water. Okay, water, guys, is good for you. And um, adult humans are 60% water, and our blood is 90% water. Okay, water is essential for the kidneys and other bodily functions. When hydrated, the skin can become more vulnerable to skin disorders and wrinkling. Drinking water instead of soda can help with weight loss. And water has lots of benefits, guys. Uh, to, to function properly, all the cells and organs of the body need water. Here are some reasons our body needs water. It lubricates the joints. Um, cartilage found in joints and the disc of the, pine, in, and disc of the spine contains around 80% water. Long-term dehydration can reduce the joints' shocking absorbing ability, leading to joint pain. And water, it, it forms saliva it, and mucus. Saliva helps us digest our food and keeps the mouth, nose, and eyes moist. This prevents friction and damage. Drinking water also keeps the mouth clean. Consumed instead of sweetened beverages, it can also reduce tooth decay. Uh, it delivers oxygen oxygen throughout the body 
blood is more than 90% water and blood carries oxygen to different parts of the body. It boosts skin health and beauty. With dehydration, the skin can become more vulnerable to skin disorders and premature wrinkling. It cushions the brain, spinal cord, and other sensitive tissues. Dehydration can affect brain structure and function. It is also involved in the production of hormones and neurotransmitters. Prolonged dehydration can lead to problems with thinking and reasoning. It regulates the body temperature, and that's water we're talking about. Okay, guys, we're still on water. We're talking about this water. And um, water that is stored in the middle layers of the skin comes to the skin surface as sweat. When the body heats up, as it evaporates, it cools the body in sport. And um, also the water, the digestion. The, the digestive system depends on it, water. The bowel needs water to work properly. Dehydration can lead to digestive problems, constipation, and overly acidic stomach. This increases the risk of heartburn and stomach ulcers. It flushes body waste. Water is needed in the processes of sweating and removal of urine and feces. It helps maintain blood pressure a lack of water can cause blood to become thicker, incre increasing blood pressure. The airway is needed. When dehydrated, airways are restricted by the body in an effort to minimize water loss. This can make asthma and allergies worse. It makes minerals and nutrients accessible. These dissolve in water, which makes it possible for them to reach different parts of the body. It prevents kidney damage. The kidney regulates fluid in the body. Insufficient water can lead to kidney stones and other problems. It boosts performance during exercise. Um, it helps in weight loss. It reduces the chance of a hangover. And um, yes, guys, so drinking plenty of water is a simple way to reduce the risk of developing a UTI and to help treat an existing UTI, urinary tract infection. Dehydration happens if we use and lose more water than the body takes. It can lead to an imbalance in the body's electrolytes. Electrolytes such as potassium, phosphate, and sodium help carry electrical signals between cells. So guys, if you like this video, uh, please give the video a thumbs up and um, don't forget to share the video with your friends and uh, turn on your post notification bell. Thanks for joining me in another video and all you lovely people have a wonderful day.